Hey guys, Tech Made Easy, and thank you so much for clicking on our video today. Well, guys, we've got the Tough Built 5 in 1 utility knife. This is really nice. It's a nice unit. It's got a pretty decent pricing as well. This thing's got a utility knife in it, it's got an integrated bit driver, a pry bar, built in blade storage, a steel belt clip, a wire cutter, and a wire stripper. Is that something? Well, let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and check this thing out. So the price on this is $16.98. Not bad. Obviously, you can get this at Lowe's. And we'll put a link in the description if it's available on Amazon also. But the, the lowest price is pretty good, $16.98. Model number on this is TB-H4-12-IM. That's a long model number. Well, we put it up on the screen for you also. This thing has a lifetime warranty, by the way. Let's take a minute now. I'm going to go over each of the functions in detail. We'll take a nice close look. So, number one, this thing is a utility knife. This little button here, right? When you click this button, nothing's going to happen. But if you click this button and go like that, it'll pop out and lock into place. Actually, it didn't lock into place, so just be aware of that. Um, again, if you press it, it'll close. And again, if you press it and go like that and let go, let's see, did it lock in place? It did lock in place. So real easy, you know, real easy to use. Built like a brick, this thing, I'll tell you. I really, really like it. I went out and bought it myself. Um, now, if you need to change the blades, real easy. You see this release button? All you do is push this little button in and pull out your blades. That's it. All right. Now, the blade material is uh, carbon steel. So let's look at feature number two. This has a built-in bit driver, and uh, there is your release button right there. You just push this in. Again, nothing's going to happen, but if you hold it and go like that, there you go. Now, be careful. If you do that with too much force, the bit will fly out. And as you can see, it's got a flat head and a Phillips head. It's actually being held in by a magnet, all right? It, it won't just fall out, but... It will come out if you if you actually open this up with enough force. All right, so again, hold that and go like that. Really cool. Press it again. Locks in place. Really, really nice. The other thing this has is a durable pry bar. Now, I closed it, but this little button here, all right, and this is plastic, by the way, this part, but this is steel. So all you do is push this in, and it locks into place, and you now have a steel pry bar. Now, closing this, a little tricky. You're going to push it forward, push it down, and pull it back. So again, pull it out, locks in place, right? Push in a little forward and then a little back, and your pry bar is uh, gone. And uh, yeah, just really... You know, I'm, I'm holding on to this thing, so it's nice to have a steel pry bar. Now, this has a built-in wire stripper and a actual wire cutter. Now, the cutter is actually, when the blade's closed, this is the cutter here. All right? You see that little blade right there is the cutter in that indent. So, there is your cutter. And I'll go ahead and show you the stripper. So basically, just open this up. There is your wire stripper. Pretty cool. Feature number five has built-in blade storage. It's actually holding three more blades. So you take this bar right here. You grab it and pull it up. Now I'll tell you, it's a little hard, so just be aware. So you just pull this up 
and you'll see here that you now have access to blades. You can just pull out a blade if you need it and push it back in. It is held in with a magnet, but uh, nice to have blade storage right on the tool. By the way, if you're a Tough Built fan, we just reviewed the Stack Tech system. Um, we actually bought a couple of the pieces and did a real good close up. Really nice stuff, not perfect. I'm not really sure if we're going to fully uh, switch to Tough Built. You know, we're using uh, Milwaukee Packout right now. But if you want to check out this video, on the upper right hand corner, we'll go ahead and post a link and uh, you'll see it pop up. Just click on that. Ready? All right, there it goes. It's popping up. Click on that to check out the video, or I'll put a link in the description. Thanks, guys. Feature number six, it's got a steel belt clip built in. This guy here, nice and long. Also with that little spot, so this can actually, you know, your belt can be in here. All right. Got good tension. So that's nice to have. So... Pretty nice to have, huh? I mean, 1698 at Lowe's. We'll try to put a link in the description. I also like that this can be used mostly with one hand, you know, when you're on a job site or something. So again, great for the homeowner, but also nice to have if you're out there and you're a contractor and stuff. Anyway, quick video. I hope uh, you found it helpful. If you did, do me a favor, give us a thumbs up. It really helps the channel. And if you want to follow us on social media, you know, Instagram, uh, Twitter, threads, right up there. TikTok, we're on there as well now, slowly. And um, if you want, check out our Tesla channel. We got a Tesla. We got almost 15,000 miles on it now. And we've done some accessory reviews. We're starting to put up content on how it is to go from a gas vehicle to a Tesla. So, I hope you subscribe. If you do, post a comment, give us a thumbs up. But guys, I hope this was helpful. I'll put some tool reviews on the right side here. And if you want to subscribe to our channel here at Tech Made Easy, I'll put our logo right there, our round Tech Made Easy logo where my finger is. Click on that. Subscribe and join the family. Guys, thanks so much. Have a wonderful day.